Good morning, y'all. I am back. I am back. I done put my hair. It's raining. I done got rain on. Hair look a bit. Okay, so y'all want to talk about Diddy and the situation. I was going to do a live. I still might do a live. I still might do a live. But um, for right now, we're going to go with the video, okay? So Diddy, y'all. Diddy has been sued. Well, was about on the verge of being sued, okay? So Casey, his ex, y'all, I don't really know much about their whole relationship or what transpired in the relationship. Um, but what I do know is she came forward with these allegations of him doing like just weird shit like making her shave her head off and shit and shit like that and you know beating on her you know db and stuff like that right which at this point it's not a surprise to me y'all it's so many of and it's always us black folks what is going on they didn't got bill cosby they didn't got r kelly did you next respectfully though and that picture i've seen of him stressed out you know sitting with his head down like that he must know it's coming like because other people are starting to come out now but my question is why are we just now speaking about it now okay she asked for 30 million i'm guessing she got the 30 million or more right whatever but my thing is was it about the money or was it about you getting justice because my thing is if he did all this egregious stuff to you why didn't first of all why didn't you bring i don't know what rapper has said this why didn't you speak about it when everything first happened that's first of all and i'm all for black women i'm all for that y'all but let's let's be real here right and i it's no doubt in my mind that he did all this shit, right but why are we speaking about it now and why why did it take the money to shut you up me oh baby we taking it to court i'm gonna get my money and your ass going to jail so all, all of this was for the money why did it take that long like you could have proved this way better back then, you know, with all the receipts back then. Why why is it taking now to come out? Like, I know that's I, I I don't agree with that. Like, it's just so weird to me. Like, why are we speaking about it now? Like I said, I don't really know too much about their relationship and the past and stuff like that. Cause I didn't keep up with these people like that. But everybody knows who P. Diddy is. And a lot it, it's been a lot of stuff in the news and articles about Diddy and you know, that other actress, and a matter of fact, Lance, me and Lance was talking the other night, Lance told me this, I forgot that boy's name, he, he's a funny creator, he said Diddy had did some break him or something, and again, y'all, everything said in this video is alleged, but, yeah, I don't know if I want to believe, believe, you know, that Diddy out here really raping little boys and shit like that, but it's like, you kind of making us have to, you know, have to look at you kind of sideways because what's going on is too many people saying the same thing about this man and then i seen another thing it was like and i my dumb ass went and looked at all the damn pictures that um young miami that posted with diddy right um casey said that um i think with casey that um but one of one of the females that came forward about him for sure with casey um diddy makes you wear white nails and I'll be damned if every picture that she went with that man, she got on white nails. I don't know, but y'all, Young Miami, you might be next, baby. You might want to chill out. And everybody, you know, everybody grew for them and shit like that. Now knowing that girl could really be going through it. But hey, if, if she getting the money, the you know, money looking good on her end from it, you know, why not? You know, for her, you know, she's a city girl. So she going to do whatever she got to do for that money, that, that money, that money, baby money baby that money baby <laughs> nah but for real though y'all i don't know i don't know how this gonna turn out but i definitely do feel because it's already people coming out now you know because they mad about um you know why they story wasn't heard but when money was involved you know that's when people start to talk about it and that's when people start to hold him accountable but if you ask me like the victims are saying he's still not held accountable because he hasn't spent a day in jail over this shit he, he came up off the 30 million and one thing i will say a lot of people saying you know that ain't shit to him that money ain't shit to him i don't give a fuck how much money you got 30 million is money that's you can invest with 30 million bro that's the money he got kids out here he got kids that like nice things he, like like that boy said on his these ain't no regular motherfucking kids these kids want to find the things they like baby so i don't know y'all but diddy <laughs> And then, y'all, 
Vicky said is the biggest motherfucking troll there is on this motherfucking app, bro. On this motherfucking social media shit. Vicky said, going one thing about Vicky said, he gonna troll your ass. And I'm telling you, Vicky said his his sheet, rap sheet must be clean. He must gotta clean his slate because you know he, he stay coming for motherfuckers until it's him. But I ain't heard no shit about him, so shit. He might be one of the good ones. He just a big ass troll. Like that motherfucker can do some fucking trolling. Like. Damn, shut your damn mouth. The hell. But no, that's how I feel, y'all. I really was gonna run alive, but shit. It ain't too much to really talk about until, you know, everything else started to come out. Because best believe some old shit gonna come out. It's too it's too many. Y'all heard like he didn't did shit the whale hanging him off the balcony for some disrespecting um Casey, um just doing weird shit to people like who the fuck is you? Who the fuck is you? And <clears throat> let me shut up. I ain't even gonna get into that. I ain't even gonna get into that. Cause that's gonna be a little too deep. But I already didn't like him back from I like his music, yeah, but that shit with um what Tupac? I think it was Pac. Biggie. What well, one of them. Right. But everybody knows Diddy is shady as fuck. And then um they say Diddy be inviting people to these damn parties and shit and then try to, you know, set them up and shit. I don't know how true that is, but I feel like personally Diddy has always been a shady ass motherfucker. Do I believe, the question is, do I believe that the motherfucker did the shit that, you know, people are saying he's doing? Absolutely. But my thing is the same thing with Bill Cosby, same thing with R. Kelly. Why the fuck are we speaking on it now, y'all? Like, why Why did it take years for you to speak out? Like, that? that's the thing I don't like. It's giving very much, oh, I want my money, you giving all these other people, like, what, 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 what is it, like, what, what is the point and purpose of coming out now, that's my whole thing, y'all, I don't really, you know, feel like, like I said, I'm for the women, if anything, but I'm gonna be honest on this side, this side of town, right, we gonna keep it all, all the way honey, and it's just weird, because, why are we speaking out now again, <laughs> like, it's, it's weird, but, you know, it is what it is. Um, Diddy, I do feel like he's probably going to end up having a lot more shit coming up about him because this some shit, y'all. This some motherfucking shit. But if y'all want to go live about it, y'all can let me know in the comment section down below. Um, it's really been a busy week for me last week, but this week is kind of chill. You know, it's a holiday week. So um, if y'all want to run a live, we definitely can do that. Y'all let me know in the comment section down below. I'm gone. I got to listen to my music. Y'all have a great evening. I love y'all a long time. Thank y'all so much for supporting me. And y'all let me know what y'all think in the comment section down below, okay?